Today, Peppa and Mummy Pig are riding the bumper cars at Potato City. Can't catch me, Rebecca! <laughs> oh, yes, I can! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Peppa! We found a new ride! It's a water ride! <laughs> I love Splashy Rides. <laughs> splashy? Mummy Pig isn't sure she loves Splashy Rides. Uh, why don't we go on a ride <laughs> without Splashes? Like, uh, oh. this bench. Ooh, what fun. Whee! <laughs> we can go on that after. Come on, Mummy! <laughs> Everyone has arrived at the new water ride. Celery stick falls. Uh oh! Stop! <laughs> oh, it is very splashy. Very, very splashy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Adults in the front, please. That means you, Mummy Pig, right here. Oh, right. Um, okay. Enjoy the ride! Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> oh. oh, this is quite lovely. Hooray! The ride is going very high up. Splash, splash, splash. We all love to splash. Uh, uh, not everyone loves to splash. You who? <laughs> Would you like a small splash, a big splash, or a humongous splash? Um, a humongous splash, please! Yeah. No. Okie dokie. Ready? Yeah. No. Five against one. Off you go! The celery stick falls are very fast and very splashy. There we are. Nice and dry. No, oh, not again. Yay! <laughs> Yay! That was amazing! <laughs> and very, very splashy! <laughs> Mummy, what are you doing? The splashes were amazing! Let's go again! Now Mummy Pig loves humongous splashes. Everyone loves humongous splashes. Today, Peppa and her friends are going to the sweet shop. Hello, Miss Rabbit. I'd like to buy everything in the sweet shop, please. Here is my coin. Peppa and her friends each have one coin to buy a sweet with. What a lot of money! But I'm afraid it's not enough to buy everything in the shop. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> One coin is perfect for trying my new sweet-making machines, though. Ooh. Just choose a machine, pop your coin in the slot and push the big red button. Mmm! Strawberry laces! Nay! But strawberries are fruits, not sweets. My sweets are made with delicious real fruit. Much tastier and much healthier. <laughs> Yummy strawberries. They look like hair. <laughs> You're right. I've got a strawberry ponytail. <laughs> <laughs> my turn, my turn. Emily Elephant has found a rainbow lollipop machine. For this machine, you have to push the buttons to choose your favourite fruity flavours. Hmm. Yellow banana. Ooh, you love red apples. And pink raspberries. And blue blueberries. And green apples. <laughs> <laughs> you like all the flavours. <laughs> So fruity! <laughs> Look, it's a big binning ball. <laughs> That's a candy floss machine. Why don't you pop your coin in and give it a go? Oh. Ooh, it tastes like coconut. <laughs> it looks just like you, Susie. And now it looks...
looks even more like you. <laughs> what is that? Only one way to find out. But I thought this was a sweetie machine, not a money machine. <gasps> Can I use this to buy some real sweeties? You don't need to. That coin is a sweetie pepper. It's a chocolate coin. Chocolate! Hooray! Peppa loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Everyone loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. <laughs> Today, Mummy Pig has brought Peppa and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello. I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy. Ooh! Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot or a princess or a silly monster or a... Dinosaur! <laughs> I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. A spaceman. A monster. A superhero. Peppa and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic... <laughs> the machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> Now, you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> there are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh, yes. Ah, oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Flying is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Whee! Wow. What is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still. What was that? Ta-da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just oh. like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny. <laughs> Whee! <gasps> and so are you. <laughs> Pepper and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello, everyone. Who's ready for a school trip in my lovely new yellow bus? Ooh. Oh, what happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice, relaxing drive. Oh, dear. Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race. So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check. Check. <laughs> then off we go. <gasps> <laughs> Whoops. Let's try again. Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. The yellow bus Ooh. is a bit fast for Madame Gazelle. Miss Rabbit, can the yellow bus play music? The yellow bus? 
grass can do lots of things. It can do this, this, oh. this, oh. and of course, this. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madam Gazelle. Aww. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round all day long. Play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye. Something beginning with R. Road. Nope. <laughs> Rabbit. Nope. It's a really big lorry. Whoa. Hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip. So it's time to get off the bus. Oh. I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry. I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus. Everyone except Madam Gazelle. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her friends have come to a special adventure park. Come on, Edmund, you can do it. It's really fun. Whoa! <laughs> ho, ho, well done, Edmund. <gasps> this room has a balance beam. You have to walk across it without falling into the ball pit. If you all keep working as a team, you'll get all the way through without falling into the ball pits. I'm good at balancing. Follow me. Now, George, Pepper, and Edmund Elephant must cross the balance beam. But Edmund is finding the balance beam a bit difficult. Try going sideways, Edmund. We can do it together. Hooray! Everyone has made it across the balance beam. Now they must swing across this room. This looks tricky. It's just like the swing in the park, Emily. Watch this. Whee! Peppa is very good at swinging. Hooray! Hold on tight, George. Whee! <laughs> Here you go, Edmund. But Edmund Elephant is feeling a little nervous about it. Why don't we go together, Edmund, as a team? Good idea! Whee! Hooray! We did it! Thank you, Emily. Everyone has made it across the big swing. Good teamwork, everyone. One room to go. <laughs> This is the final Whoa! room, but there is no way across the ball pit. We can't jump that far. And there's nothing to swing on. Ho, ho, ho. This room is a bit of a puzzle. <gasps> Nobody knows how to solve the puzzle and get across. Oh. I've got it. But Edmund Elephant is very <gasps> good at puzzles. <laughs> A clever clogs, you know. <laughs> Everyone has made it through the adventure park. That was very clever, Edmund. Edmund? And Edmund Elephant can't wait to do it all over again. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? 
It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house, please? Please? Hello, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um... Rabbit. But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. <laughs> Hooray! Ooh! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Peppa is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. <laughs> Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make Peppa and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> <laughs> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh! Whee! And it's very windy. <laughs> Look! After the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Slide! <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone <laughs> loves the fun house because the fun house is very... Tonight, Mummy and Daddy Pig are going out for a Valentine's Day meal. Uh -huh. Mummy Pig has ordered a taxi. <gasps> it's almost here. Hooray! Hooray! Oh. Right awaits, madam. <gasps> oh, um... Mummy Pig has accidentally ordered a special taxi called a limousine. <laughs> a limo? How romantic! And tickly! <laughs> Where are we off to, sirs and madams? Granny and Grandpa Pig's house, if you please, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Pepper and George are going there for dinner. Dinner! <laughs> <laughs> okay, calm down, you two. <laughs> oh, this music reminds me of Venice. <laughs> what a wonderful trip that was. <gasps> <gasps> now it's a disco Yay! limo! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> we didn't have this in Venice. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Care for a oh. chocolate, Mummy Pig? <laughs> oh, don't mind if I can. Can we have some, Daddy? Chocolate. <laughs> um, okay, but not too many. Oh. Peppa and George love chocolate. <laughs> Maybe a little too much. I guess I'll have this one then. <laughs> Can we have the disco music again? <laughs> Just until Granny and Grandpa's house, please. <laughs> oh. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> 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 
good. It's just like that time in Paris, Grandpa Pig. Everyone <laughs> loves celebrating Valentine's Day, but Mummy and Daddy Pig love their disco limo ride most of all. Peppa and her family are out in the car. Oh, But they're having a bit of trouble. Oh, dear. The car won't start. You've broken down. Oh. Don't worry. I'll take you to the garage. I'll be back in a jiffy. <laughs> Mr. Bull is towing the car away to be fixed. George and Peppa like being towed. Hmm. Aha! Oh, dear. I see. Well, we can fix it. Oh, good. But we'll have to order a new part. It won't be easy or cheap. Oh. Oh, oh dear. How long will it take? It will take oh, as long as it takes. But how will I get to work? There's lots of cars you can use while yours is being fixed. Follow me. There's lots of spare cars at the garage. Pick any one you like. <gasps> A motorbike. This is perfect. Oh. Let's take it for a test drive. Daddy Pig likes riding the motorbike. Hello. But motorbikes don't keep you dry in the rain. Hmm. Maybe we need something a bit tougher. Let's try this. Pepper has found a monster truck, which is very tough. I think a monster truck might be a bit too tough for what we need. Sorry. What about something nice and spacious, like this mm. bus? Ah. <laughs> Mummy Pig likes the bus very much. Ooh. Ah. It's ever so roomy and peaceful. Oh, dear. But everyone thinks it's a real bus. There's only one car left for Peppa and her family to try. It's a bit smelly. That's because it's my lorry for collecting the recycling. So you can't take that one, I'm afraid. I'm not sure we'll ever find a car as perfect as our car. <laughs> well, that's lucky. You took so long to pick a new car that we managed to fix your old one. Hooray! <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Bull. Thank you, Grandad Dog. <laughs> Pepper's family like driving different cars, but they like driving their family car most of all. Today, Pepper and her family are going on the night train to a very far away seaside. It's bedtime now. We can play with the beach ball tomorrow at the beach. But I don't want to go to sleep. Well, we're not going to sleep yet. We're having a sleepover. Yay! Peppa and George <laughs> love sleepovers. Can we have a midnight feast? You need to have a midnight feast at a sleepover, Daddy. It's the rules. Right you are. Follow me. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone has come to the dining carriage to get the midnight feast. Hello. Oh. Hello. What would you like? We'd like a midnight feast, please. One. <gasps> midnight feast coming up. Here you go. Fruit and warm milk. Perfect before a good sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Everyone tucks into their midnight feast, gives their teeth a good brush, and gets comfy in bed. Can we have a bedtime story? Oh, OK, Peppa. Just one story, and then sleep. Hooray! This is the story of the magic night train. Ooh! 
Once upon a time, there was a magic night train, which didn't need train tracks because it could fly. Pepper had a wonderful dream about a magical night train. Look, we arrived at the seaside. Pepper and her family have arrived at the very far away seaside, and they all enjoyed their train sleepover. Today, Pepper and George are playing grown-ups. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown up? Dinosaur! <laughs> George wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm, I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm, interesting. Uh, 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 hang all right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Who's next? Silly George, dinosaurs don't go to the dentist, <laughs> they go to Dr Hamster the vet. Wow. But you can have a sticker anyway. I think you'd make a very good dentist. Dinosaur! <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But... I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, the <laughs> park. Stop! You forgot us. Come back. <laughs> vroom. Vroom. <laughs> <laughs> You have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. <laughs> then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> <laughs> Dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always love jumping in muddy puddles, even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. 